This segment is going to cover a universal knee immobilizer because the universal measurements do not need to be taken. So we'll just show you the application of the device. The universal knee immobilizer has pre-shaped steels in the posterior. Uh, obviously this is the upper end. Uh, it's contoured to the popliteal area and then contoured around the calf for patient comfort. And we have that contouring, we get maximum motion control. Uh, to fit one of these, I'm going to take the sidebars off and, and remove those. And that one goes there and take this one off. Because they will be customized to the patient's leg. Uh, now I can put this on the extremity. If I can have your leg and go ahead and extend it, just go ahead and put it down if you, if you can. Making sure that, that it's contoured to her calf area. And there's just a simple closure here to keep the garment on and put a little bit of pressure right over the knee area. Um, now we can take these sidebars and, and that's gonna provide the actual immobilization for the, for, the, for the leg. These are to be put on to the very lateral and very medial of the leg, not towards the front or towards the back. It can only support the knee if it's on the very inside and very outside of the leg. And the nice thing about these is, if this is put over dressing and, and the leg is swollen, uh, we can still put it here. Uh, a day or two later, a week or two later, we can take these off and reposition them. If the dressings come off and the leg gets smaller, then we can reposition this. So it's always to the outside, always to the very inside. So these simply attach then with Velcro. I'm gonna make sure that it's to the very outside, very inside, like so. And do the same thing here. Uh, again, if it's to the front or towards the back, it can't support the knee. We want this to the very lateral and very medial, uh, about there. And then I can do the Velcro loop and lock closure. And these are length adjustable straps where there's a separate Velcro tab here. And if you need to, you can set this like this, set the Velcro hook there and then trim off the excess. So they're uh, length adjustable straps. Uh, again, I like to do the strap immediately below the knee first, then above the knee, and adjust the length of that strap, like so. And then we'll do the distal one. And here I have excess foam. You would actually just go take a scissors and cut that off. I'll fold it over for now. Do that strap and do the proximal strap and adjust the length of that. So, and I could trim that strap off. So that would be the application of a universal knee immobilizer. As the leg gets smaller, these can be removed and repositioned so they're very lateral, very medial.